In my position, I'm, I'm having two roles, uh, two hats. Uh, one side, I'm high performance sports director. That means uh, I'm responsible for the whole development of high performance sport within Switzerland. And on the other side, I'm uh, head of the delegation, like chef de mission for the NOC Switzerland. One side developing, on the other side performing. I was in Salt Lake working uh, for a TV station doing statistics. Uh, I was in Torino and Vancouver as an athlete in Sochi uh, as deputy chef de mission. I think the mix of this experience helps me a lot to understand the athlete side on one side and the other side, the management side, and, and, and that's not always the same view. So it's sometimes hard to make a decision because you drop to one on the, or the other side, and, and, and that's a big challenge. And mixing these two challenges together makes me well prepared to, do, to take on this, this position. As I'm leading the mission, I, I'll be in the background as long as things are running smoothly. And therefore, I need to be in the front if there's something going to the wrong direction. I'm, I'm really in the background, uh, leading my team, and will be well prepared if some problems pop up. When we're talking about medals and diplomas, uh, there are not many athletes that are able uh, to perform at, at that level. But still, I mean, if I take, uh, for example, tennis, it's amazing. I mean, we have five players and most of them in the top 10 of, of the world with Peter Wawrinka, Benci, Chingis and uh, Baczynski. So on that side, I'm very happy, but they need to be ready uh, when the games begin. So at, at at that moment it's hard to, when we talk about medals, to talk about an expectation. It's the international comparison every four years. So it's a time frame that's quite long. So you will need to wait another four years till you're able to perform again. And having a team, like not just your own sports team, you're performing at Europeans or World Championships, but you have Team Switzerland, so finally you're together in a team with the big names as well, as I was talking before, with uh, Spiri, with uh, Gerda, Cancellara, and Federer. And this gives uh, a very positive emotion and great memories to all the athletes uh, that are part of the Swiss team. Olympic Village, that's going to be amazing. Uh, I've been there and it's on a beautiful place just beside uh, the sea. Uh, within uh, over 200 countries moving around uh, the village, you see very happy, emotional, positive people because they might just perform well. Uh, on the other side, you meet people, they're completely down as their performance was not what uh, on their expectation. That's hard to describe because it's full of emotions. It's not so easy to organize games uh, as they're like in an attitude, well, at the end it's going to work and easy. That's not the Swiss way. We want to have structure and uh, answers on our questions. Uh, but personally, I can handle that. So I'm very positive and looking forward to very cool games.